It's not your average cement mixer, but this isn't your average cement. The base product used to produce these test bricks comes from landfill waste which isn't usable or recyclable like metals or plastics are. It comes from this kind of excess landfill waste, which would be buried under the ground like at this municipal landfill. The aim of the project is to take this waste out of the landfills and process it in order to recuperate the most out of it, to recover recyclable materials, uh, to produce alternative fuels, uh, and of course to decrease the amount of waste that uh, is being kept in these reservoirs that are still contaminating the environment. If the research team are able to prove that the so-called mining of these sites can be economically profitable, there will be over 150,000 non-sanitary landfills across Europe which could be dug up. Last year this landfill processed over 120,000 tonnes of waste, but it's due for closure in 2020. The clearing project is ambitious. It wants to re-excavate all 53 hectares of the site so that one day there's no trace that this landfill was ever here. The team is continuing to test the bricks here in the lab to prove that they can be used for industrial purposes. And they're working in conjunction with another project here at Leuven University, looking at extracting minerals and critical metals from industrial waste in Europe, which can be used in green energy production hardware like wind turbines and solar panels. Currently around 90% of those materials are freshly mined in China. The focus is on recovering the metals in such a way that we can also valorize the resi residual fraction in building materials ideally as a geopolymer cement because the added value there is much larger than when you produce aggregates to replace aggregates in, in concrete but for example then you're speaking about one euro per ton if you speak about producing cement you drive up the value to 40, 50, 60 euros per ton. The new mine project has received $4.5 million in funding from the EU. The researchers hope that one day the foundations of buildings in European cities could be built with bricks created from the waste of previous generations. Jack Parrick, CGTN, Leuven, Belgium.